a blue of Florida. He's an Everbay Bay fighter. Trained out of Everbay Bay 24-7. Coached by Ryan Robertson. By way of Perth, Western Australia. For the record of one fight, for one draw. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jesse Clinic, coached by Ben Vickers, by way of Jelton, weighing at 57 kilograms, for the record of one fight, for one win, ladies and gentlemen, Darcy Spurlock! Stadium Club in Perth. Oh, my name is Jake O'Driscoll and my co-host Sam Holder. How's it going everyone? Um, we're here to see first Darcy Sproul Ward versus Jesse Sayers. Um, should be an interesting matchup. I don't think you could find a more different mix of bodies here. Um, so here we go. Darcy to longer range. Jesse, the small built flyweight. Uh, he's definitely one of the most built flyweights I've ever seen. Yeah, absolutely. Darcy coming out straight away with the body kick. And they're up on the cage. Jesse scores a takedown early. And he's got side control. Jesse, very strong from this position. He used the clinch last time to try and get some takedowns in his last fight. Um, that ending in a draw. But he's got some early success here. Darcy looking to get back to guard. He's getting, he's very flexible off his back, so he's looking to get his, his legs back in. And he's very difficult to hold down. And he's almost back in now. And he, he locks up the full guard. Just controlling that posture at the moment. Darcy's very, very savvy off his back. Jesse's putting a lot of pressure with the head. Uh, a lot of head control and keeping those elbows nice and tight. Um, looking to control. Darcy's just trying to minimize damage at this stage. Darcy now moving, bringing his guard up a bit higher. Passing the half guard now. Jesse's got an underhook and looking to punch. And Darcy's looking to hip escape out. Very good control here from Jesse. And he's looking to pass again. He still has that underhook. He's got him trapped. Jesse passes. He's looking for a Kimura. Darcy escapes. Jesse doing a really good job of keeping that pressure down at the moment. We're halfway through this round, so the amateur fights will be three three-minute rounds. No elbows on the ground, um, and clearly no, no knees or, or kicks to the head. Again, Jesse's got that underhook. Darcy's coming up. Needs to protect his neck here. And he's pushed back against the fence again. Jesse with a nice underhook again, and he's looking, Darcy looking for the guillotine. Well done. He's got it. Head out. Another nice take down against the fence for Jesse. Darcy minimizing damage on the ground, but he is getting controlled. Still controlling that posture really well, just minimizing the damage that he's taking. But um, Jesse's definitely doing a good job keeping that pressure down and, and not, not taking Darcy looking himself. for a triangle, looking to walk his legs up nice and high. He's looking for a triangle. Jesse does have good posture though. His corner's yelling for him to explode out. Darcy's got his legs up high. He needs to grab his shin here. He's locked it up. There's only 20 seconds left. 20 seconds left. He's got it nice and deep. Jesse looks to be surviving. He just needs to cut that angle a bit more. 10 seconds left. 10 seconds left. Jesse looks like he's going to hold on here. He's still trying to fight. Darcy looking to switch the arm. Good first round. Great first round. Awesome effort by both fighters. Uh, when I go to touch you, just like, so I can tell you around one, ten seconds, I'm going to show you. Okay.
Jesse definitely took the first round with that takedown control, but that near submission might give um, Darcy some confidence right at the end there. Oh, that leg kick looked like it hurt him a little bit there. He switched stance now. It'll be interesting to see how long Darcy... Darcy looking to initiate the takedown now. He's giving up double underhooks there. Darcy looking to take his back in. They're back in close guard. But this time they're in Jesse's corner. Last time they were over in Darcy's corner. Now we're right in front of Jesse getting commands here. One butterfly hook for Darcy and an overhook. He's going to look to try and get that leg out. But Jesse's just looking to look to control with the forehead and keep him pinned down. He's doing a good job there, Jesse. He's a very well built fighter. He obviously trains very, very hard. Looking for that. Here is Armbar looking for it again. Oh, armbar, yeah. Jesse looking to power out of it. He's got his. Jesse looking to power out of it. Darcy does need to squeeze his knees together to look to finish. Can he extend here? Can he extend Jesse out? This is where Jesse's build is going to help him here. Jesse's doing a really good job here defending. Really good job. He's still very deep. He's looking at posture and power out. And he's going to get that arm free. He's Switch back to the. Now, yeah. Oh, no triangle. Back to close guard. Nice attempt off his back there from Darcy. Yeah, very good work by Darcy there. And again, he's throwing those legs up high. Good hammer fist by Jesse. Nice hammer fist. He's controlling the throat and keeping him pinned to the ground. and Posturing up and then laying those hammer fists down. Yeah, he's doing a really good job with that. Darcy really needs to work here. Again, we're two minutes through this round and he's been put on his back again. We don't know how the judge is going to score this for the takedown or for the submission attempts. Again, Darcy walking up, walking up. Jesse really just looks like he just wants to control. He's very comfortable here, yeah. holding Darcy down. Yep. Making sure he doesn't get submitted. There's that arm again. Again. There's that arm. This is a bit tighter. Jesse again does a great job of defending. And lands another couple of hammer He just really needs to extend those legs a little bit more. It's, it's really tight that. this time. That's, that's and there's the tap. Darcy by Amba. Darcy by Amba. And he's really fired up. He's really fired up. That was awesome. What a great win there by yeah. Darcy. Yeah. Jesse really did really well with the takedowns, but Darcy was able to take control towards the end and land that armbar. Please don't turn me away. Just another painful today. Oh, I'm a Ferrari, Carl, and Tell Anna calls a stop to the fight. Two minutes, 32 seconds into round number two. For your winner, via armbar, out of the red corner, Darcy Spowall.